what's up guys welcome back once again it is me Molt. I'm so happy to be here with you guys um, today yeah I had an awesome weekend with my wife for our anniversary we went to wild dunes in Charleston hung out on the beach the weather was amazing but I'm back now making videos for you guys we are about to hit 7,000 subs guys like are you serious this is so freaking ridiculous to me my mind is blown um, I really can't believe it. It's it's unbelievable to me, which is why I just said I can't believe it. <laughs> um, but I'm so excited about it, and um, you know, the sky's the limit right now for me. I know that we're just going to keep growing, and I'm super excited, as I just said. Um, I'm just training up some troops right now. But guys, thank you so much for all the support, um, for being here with me. We have another episode of Let's Clash right here. Um, first, I just want to um, talk about the video that I just posted before this about Samurai Siege. Once again, guys, that game is not at all going to take the place of Clash. Um, we're going to have a good mixture of it. Um, I post Clash every day. If you look at most of the other big YouTubers, guys, they post like once every two to three days. So y'all are getting more from me. If you want to complain, go ahead. I don't really care. Uh, my true fans are here for me and I appreciate everything from y'all. So here's what we're doing today, okay? We need to get, dang it, I shouldn't have trained up those troops. Well, maybe I should have. All right, so in order to upgrade this barrack right here, we need 700,000. So we need to find a base with 100,000 elixir that we can snag. Um, as you can see, we are still upgrading our walls. That is the last thing that we have to upgrade from gold. We can't, we can't upgrade the spell factory. We can't upgrade any of our, um, any of our defenses at all they're all maxed out as you can see we can upgrade mines excuse me but I don't really want to upgrade those at this point I know that it's not that much it's only well it's 28,000 um, so I'm not really too worried about those um, I am I right, so I can't upgrade that either until we move on so the last gold upgrade we have is going from Town Hall 6 to Town Hall 7 which is going to be big, but I'm going to max out all my walls before I do that. So why don't we go ahead and attack, guys, with the goal in mind of getting 100,000 elixir, okay? So hey, look at that, right off the bat. Um, we have a base that could have 100,000, or definitely has 100,000 elixir, and we're just going to have to see how we're going to be able to get it, okay? Um, we definitely want to attack from this right side over here to get rid of his mortars, because I don't want those messing around with us. Um... Right now, this is the army comp I've been running with for a while. Um, we're going to go ahead and drop down our uh, giants right there. And once those mortars land, we'll drop down a couple wall breakers. And as you see, our giants are losing a little bit of health, but that's okay. Once they get down to around half, we're going to go ahead and drop this healing spell to get that in there. Let's drop down these wizards as well, and then spread out some archers at the same time. Um, we can also easily take down these cannons with our barbarians and our archers, so I'm not too worried about that. Um, our giants are moving in over here. Let's drop down another healing spell right there. Drop down some goblins, see if they can get inside for us. Um, and then let's start picking off all these easy things around the side. So we are watching our elixir right now, and as I said earlier, we really want to make sure that we can get um, 100, we want to be up to 700,000 elixir, especially since we already have that other army camp training and look at that he does have a couple of troops in his clan castle hopefully these barbarians over here will distract them because we are almost to, there we go we just broke 700,000 so that's perfect that's exactly what we want especially since we already have another army training up we don't have anything to spend our elixir on um i actually i actually definitely over um <laughs> over deployed on this i wasn't expecting that that's kind of funny um, so there we go guys that's an awesome raid uh, one thing that you really need to make sure you do when you go into an attack is go into it with a mission like I told you guys on this one my mission was getting to 700,000 elixir so that, so, blah, sorry. <laughs> so that I could upgrade one of my barracks now one thing that's gonna suck is when I upgrade my barracks it is going to um, obviously it's going to mess up my production time of these guys so I'm gonna upgrade this one right over here um, we're gonna upgrade there we go two days to healers um, awesome so we have I guess that is a hundred one million four hundred thousand elixir left to upgrade the other barracks and then um, all of the army camps are at level six right now so those are maxed as you can see we can't upgrade those anymore 
Goodness. <laughs> I think on my Town Hall 8, I have level 6 army camps. Sweet! Okay, so, um, so that's where we're at with that, guys. All of our gold upgrades are done. We have all of our defenses maxed out. I am doing this the right way this time. Sorry for that text message. That's my sister-in-law. Um, so, yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. You guys are awesome. You are so much cooler than me. Um, oh, I wanted to do one more thing. I'm going to go in here, and I know I don't just want to leave you guys with um, just one attack. Okay, so um, can I replay? Yeah, why don't we replay this one down here that I won, and you'll see how I use this strategy. Once again, so this base was hilarious. Um, it was all just in there, kind of spread out. So I dropped down my giants once again, um, let them get a little low on health, and then we're going to drop the healing spell right there as we get our barbarians in there. Um, at lower levels, I'm not really using air um, air units just because they're not going to do that much for me. Um, I'd rather just use all these ground troops and use healing spells. So that's why I'm not using any lightning spells, in case y'all were wondering. Um, so I drop another healing spell over there with that giant and the rest of those troops so that we can take out that archer tower um, and so that those goblins can get over to that gold storage alive, even though there they go, they are about to die. Um, so we're doing okay with loot on this one so far. We've got almost uh, 70,000 gold, and here comes a huge herd of archers into the center of the base, and that mortar is almost down, and we are not going to get that mortar. It was seriously one arrow away. <laughs> um, but as you can see up at the top of the base, guys, we have that cleared out. So we are freely shooting all that gold, getting over 100,000 in gold. At this level, I'm always happy with 100,000 or more gold um, because it can be hard to come by. So right now we're just getting a little bit of elixir to help us train up some more troops. That is about to go down, and then we're just going to work our way around. Let's fast forward a little bit. Blah, blah, blah. Speed, speed, speed. There we go. So we got 112,000 gold, 82,000 elixir, and 16 trophies, guys. That's just another attack to show you guys with this composition that I'm running with. It's been working really well for me. I like it a lot. Um, try it out if you are a Town Hall 6 and see what you can do with it. All right. As always, guys, as I just said, um, y'all are awesome. You are so much cooler than me. Hey, guys, let's keep clashing, all right? Um, I love this series. I'm having fun with it. Comment below if you like it or not. If you're growing with me, what town hall you are. If you're a town hall six and you're kind of doing these things at the same pace, that's so awesome to know. But as always, guys, keep calm and clash on for me, right? I'll see you later.